George, and we would like to take this time to encourage America and all the folks who reside in America to exercise their civil right to vote in the upcoming election. That's right, we want every able-bodied man and not women. No, not women. They're not men. They can't vote. Can they? Could you imagine Buford voting? Oh, the country would be bankrupt by supper time that it would. Too late, George. Besides, do you think they'd be busy cleaning the kitchen or Squeegee in the pond. <laughs> Women. They're like America's Lysol or something. Well, anyway, about these two guys in this here election. So there's this one guy. Yeah. Then there's this other guy. Right? Yeah. Slightly darker. Mm -hmm. And they're both racing against each other. Running, Bill. It's the same thing. No, see, every race has a finish line. But once you're in office, you just gotta keep running and running and running and running. Well, anyways, we ain't gonna vote. And that's why we're asking you to. Because we don't believe in them automatic teller machines. What do they even tell her? They tell her that she can't vote. They can't vote, but they sure can cook. Oh, you sure know how to turn a phrase, Bill. That's mighty kind of you, George. And if you don't vote, I'll be a god-awful drought. That's right, we gotta earn our due. Our Mountain Dew! <laughs> <laughs> oh, Bill. Oh, George. Vote!